Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Today I'm back again with another absolutely amazing flavor profile from Mr. Kyle Colson of Hella Hot Hot Sauce. There he is right there. And this one is uh, his Mulberry Habanero. And I believe this is one of his seasonal uh, hot sauces that he does not make um, all year round. Uh, but just when I guess mulberries are uh, available. But uh, let me go ahead and read what it says on the side on this one. It says, after searching the world over for the best hot sauce, we decided to obey our own irrepressible urge to create a hot sauce like none other. Recipes flowed and the people spoke. I'll take one of each. All right. Now, one thing that uh, if you watch some of my earlier reviews for Kyle and Hella Hot Hot Sauces, uh, you know that uh, I've said that he is... Uh, just a master at blending some unique, uh, crazy uh, flavor profiles with uh, lots of different ingredients. He is not afraid to think out of the box, and that's one thing that I really uh, dig about these hot sauces. Um, and the ingredients on this one, we start off with uh, two fiery little peppers, the habanero and the Thai chili. Uh, then we have orange juice, mulberry, distilled vinegar, brown sugar, white distilled vinegar, uh, lemon juice, jalapeno, uh, tomatoes, sea salt, herbs, and spices. Another unique thing about Kyle's sauces is his use of herbs and spices. It's kind of his signature, signature thing on his sauces. Um, this one is a little bit uh, different in consistency than a lot of the other ones that I've reviewed. This is more of a loose, um, uh, thinner, uh, definitely dark mulberry, you know, fruit-based hot sauce. I mean, you can definitely see bits and pieces of the uh, the spices that are in here, the herbs that are in here, and it has that nice dark uh, mulberry flavor. Now, if you've not, uh, you know, I haven't really um, reviewed any hot sauces that uh, are made with mulberries, but uh, it's a little bit different. I guess very similar uh, to a um, a blackberry. Uh, it's tart, slightly sweet, and that's a uh, exactly what you're getting in the aroma on this one but the one thing that really comes up once again on the aromas on these sauces is Kyle's signature um, herb uh, aroma and spices he likes to use mint uh, I mean, there may be mint in this one just kind of picking up on that vibe a little bit but uh, once again uh, you also get uh, not only the herbs and the spices but you're getting that fruitiness uh, spiciness from the peppers uh, does not have a um, really a, a strong vinegar aroma, but you're getting some tartness there, you know, from the um, from the orange juice and the uh, the vinegar and the lemon juice. But just another amazing um, aroma. All right, let's go ahead and taste this, and I'll show you what I did with this sauce. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Wow. You get the herbs, you get the spices. You get that nice mulberry, that tart, um, slightly sweet um, flavor. You definitely get the sting, you know, pretty much immediately from the combination of the habaneros and the Thai chilies that are in here. Um, another thing he loves to use is those Thai pe peppers. Um, you get that, uh, that uh, citrus uh, from the orange juice, from the uh, from the lemon juice, um, but just another amazing uh, flavor profile. I think the mulberries is really coming through on this one, plus the heat of the habanero peppers, uh, but just a natural sweetness uh, from the mulberries, not sugary sweet at all, but a very, very unique sauce. If you like blackberries, blueberries uh, in a hot sauce, which is something really spicy, then you're probably going to really dig this one. But let me show you what I did with this. Um, you know, he's uh, Kyle's really kind of forcing me to get a little bit creative in what I do with his sauces um, because they're so unique. He's really unique in making his flavor profile, so uh, I'm going to be unique in how I use them. So uh, check this out. Um, what I did with this one is I made a what I call a mulberry habanero balsamic reduction and put that on top of some grilled halibut steaks has some fresh uh, sauteed green beans with some brown rice and that stuff is amazing so uh, I wanted this to be the star of the show so I just mainly used uh, this sauce add a little bit of um, uh, honey and some balsamic vinegar 
and reduce that down and uh, put that on top of the halibut steaks and it was amazing just simply incredible so this is another winner i'm going to give this a strong nine out of ten for flavor and on heat definitely about a four out of ten for heat good amount of habanero and thai uh, burn all over the mouth um, really really good stuff um, highly recommended but i don't know if this is available right now uh, contact him on facebook um, I'll put the link for Hella Hot Hot Sauce down in the description. It's hellahothotsauce.com. But you may need to contact him on Facebook to see if this one is available. But give him a like on Facebook if you haven't already. Kyle, thank you very much for sending it. I do appreciate it. Stay tuned for more reviews, guys. And until the next time, enjoy the burn. We'll see you in the next review.